some Warzone Pacific gamers are currently having performance issues while in a match. The thing about these issues is that they often result in frustrating gameplays as graphics might skip often. Welcome to our channel, and in this video, we will show you what to do if you're experiencing lags, stuttering and FPS drops while gaming with Warzone Pacific on a Windows 11 PC. The first thing you have to do is to check your internet connection. If you have a slow internet or a connection with high latency, online games will often stutter or even disconnect you from the server. We cannot stress enough how important a fast and stable internet connection is when you're gaming with Warzone or any online game for that matter. One way to know more about your connection is to do a speed test. You can either log on to speedtest.net or download its application from the Microsoft Store and do a speed test. If your connection is way lower than what you should be getting, then that should be the problem. Most of the time, you can fix a slow connection by rebooting your router or modem. Doing so will refresh the connection between your computer and your router. Or better yet, use a wired connection to make it more stable. However, if your connection is fine and the game continues to lag and stutter, you should check the servers. There is server maintenance every now and then and that might be the reason why the game's performance is a mess. Just launch a browser and then log on to support.activision.com and then click on Online Services. Select Warzone from the drop-down, and you'll immediately see if there's currently some issues with the servers. If there is, then all you have to do is wait until the problem is resolved. Most of the time, it will take less than an hour to have everything work normally again. But assuming your connection is good and there are no issues with the server, the next thing you have to do is to check your computer itself. First, Make sure that it's running the latest version of Windows 11, and then try updating your graphics card driver. You may also want to enable the hardware accelerated GPU scheduling on your PC to improve its performance. To do so, launch Settings, and then click Display, which is under the System tab. Scroll down a little bit and click Graphics. Click on Change Default Graphics Settings, and then click the switch to turn it on. After doing that, reboot your PC. Once the reboot is finished, launch Warzone Pacific again and see if the problem is fixed. After checking your connection, the servers in your computer and the stuttering continues, then it's time you change the settings in the game itself. It might have been set to use some settings that your computer can't render. These issues are actually common to computers with lower hardware specs. To do this, launch Warzone first. Once you're on the main screen, click options at the lower left corner of the screen. Click Graphics to reveal the display settings. Now pay attention to the VRAM usage at the bottom right corner of the screen. There is a thin bar that says Max and that's what you need to hit. Your settings must be within that limit. Click Quality and then set the streaming quality to Low. Set the texture resolution to Low, and then check the VRAM usage to see if it's within the limit. If it is, don't change any setting anymore, otherwise, continue tweaking the settings until you're within the limit. Once you're finished changing the settings, click Apply Settings. At this point, the lags and stuttering should already be fixed. So try gaming with Warzone again and enjoy. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, we'd love it if you tap the thumbs up button below and subscribe to our channel. We will be publishing more helpful videos every day, so stay tuned.